Hello and welcome to the Mag Show. Oh crap, this is not the Mag Show. Hello and welcome to Story Time with Mags. The Mag Show is more like serious stuff. This is more like stupid stuff that you just want to... So I could not figure out what to talk about today. I was going to talk about the times I almost got kicked out of the military. Today, I'm going to share with you guys uh, this one guy in the fire department. This one guy, just, just, you know, every fire department or any workplace has that one guy. And I'm going to tell you about this one guy today. No, I'm not going to say his name. I'm going to call him Steve. Fire Steve, okay? One day, I'm sitting in a computer room. I'm just doing my CDCs, you know, fire department homework or whatever. And realistically, I'm looking at a discount tire. So I'm looking at tires. And old Fire Steve comes over and he's like, hey, what you doing? I'm just like, oh, I'm just looking at tires, man. Uh, going to get some new tires to the forerunner, you know, beef it up a little bit. And he's like, are you, are you going to buy the tread or the whole thing? And I say, no, I'm... I'm buying the whole tire, like, all in one piece. <laughs> Me and my buddy, Dorsey, and Fire Steve. Fire Steve's driving. Uh, we're going to this place called Rio Doso, New Mexico. And so we're driving up there from Alamogordo. We're cruising along, and the sun sets. And all of a sudden, I notice all this guy's gauges, everything's pitch black, except for his dome lights on. So picture, his dome lights on, all his gauges pitch black. Everything's pitched back in the car except for this dome light. I was like, hey, man, uh, what's up with your gauges? Um, why'd your dome light on? He's like, oh, my gauges don't work. I'm just like, really? And I just reach over and I'm just like, I spin that little wheel on the side of the dash. All of a sudden, his gauges go and light up. And he's like, holy smokes, how'd you do that? How long have you had this car? He's like, a year and a half. Are you serious? You've been driving this car for a year and a half with the dome line because you couldn't figure out seriously. So, another time. So, Fire Steve's my piss mate. Okay? So, when, now what a piss mate is, is this is my dorm and this is his dorm, right? And then we have a bathroom separating our dorms, right? And so, he's our piss mate. We, we share a bathroom together. We're, I usually leave my bathroom unlocked because this guy offers me free booze all the time, right? And this guy's off, man. He's off. But, you know, it's just like whatever, bro, right? And uh, uh, no one in the fire department really likes this guy just because he's just... We have a feeling he's going to bring a gun in one day and just shoot everyone. He, he, he's like... He has that, that kind of look to his eyes. Thousand yard stare of him actually looking through you instead of at you. So, I remember he comes in my room one day and... He's moving because he's getting kicked out for stalking this one girl, right? <laughs> Normal stuff in the Air Force. He's got this 55-gallon fish tank. Full water fish, you know. And he's like, hey, can I just ship this like this? And I was like, wait, like with the water and fish in it? And he's like, yes. Like, no. No, no, no. You got to empty the water out. It, they, 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 it's too heavy in the first place. You're going to have to empty it out. I mean, the thing weighs like, this thing probably weighs like 300 pounds at least. And he's like, you know. So I was like, no, you have to empty it out, you got to empty the fish out, you got to empty the water out, you got to ship it separate, and you got to put your fish in baggies and try to ship them without them dying. The most clueless person I've ever met in my life. Like, it was just like, wow, wow. Like, how did you make it through the military? Just through the fire department. I mean, just the fire department in general. Like, that's just, if you saw what we had to go through, you're like, how the hell did you make it through that? <sighs> I'll see you later.